G'day, welcome to another episode of Country Life on the Coast. My name is Sean. Today's episode, just a quick video showing you some maintenance that you need to do on your whippersnipper. So this is a Still FS81, and I know all the Still whippersnippers are similar sort of design to this. Uh, I'm not sure about the other whippersnippers, but at the head, at the main head of it, there's a little bit of maintenance that you need to do every now and again. And it's something that a lot of people don't realize that you should do, and that's putting some grease in there. So this video is just showing you and letting people know that this is something you need to do. So I'll show you how to do it on our whippersnipper. And if your whippersnipper has this bolt on the head or, or similar sort of design to this, then I'd recommend you need to do it on yours as well. Bought a new container of grease, specifically steel grease for it, and we'll put that in here. So I'll bring the camera over here, show you what we're looking at, and we'll grease this up. So on the head, clean the gunk off a bit. So we need to remove this one here. Same size Torx bit as everything else. Oh, okay. So after a bit of effort, we've got this undone. So we just unscrew that, grab our tube of steel grease. So I bought the 80 gram, I think it was about $20. But this should screw straight in here. So it, you screw it in, it seals up, and then you just squeeze this and just spin the shaft just a little bit. And initially I could feel stuff going in there. But now it doesn't feel like it's going in anymore. That's all it is. Let me unscrew that. Just sort of see the grease in there. So we just do the cap back on and that's it. Well there we have it, just a little bit of maintenance, a little bit of work to do, put a bit of grease in there and it'll help the whippers tipper last longer. Well that's all we have for this episode so thank you so much for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button, that would be fantastic and we'll catch you on the next one. God bless.